Today we're going to talk about the uh, your winch cable. Uh, we recommend the best type of cable to use is a uh, flex core cable. Uh, it's, it's more flexible, it's more easy to work with, and also with a swivel hook. See the swivel hook here it doesn't, uh, doesn't twist the cable. Also, you got a safety latch right here. If the safety latch gets broken or whatever, you need to replace that. Uh, because CHP will not allow it to, you to use it without the safety latch, okay? Also here we got another cable. It's a positive lock, uh, lock hook. It basically locks in. And basically it's going to stay there. It's not going to, uh, it's not going to lose the, uh, the uh, bridle or whatever you got on the end of it. Uh, this is also a, a fiber core cable. Uh, this is 3 8 by 50. Uh, recommended for a, most of your car carriers. Uh, this cable is about uh, $62 for for this cable here. With a positive light, black is about $92. Uh, we're going to show you two on this older truck here uh, about the cable. If it doesn't have a cable tensioner on it, uh, I'm going to pull this cable off and uh, you can see how it messes up uh, here on the winch itself. the cable just unspools and, and just goes nuts without a cable tensioner. So it's very important to have a cable tensioner on it. it saves the life of your cable. Now I'm going to pull the cable out here on the car carrier and show you how the cable stays intact because it's got a cable tensioner down in here. It's also got a cable roller here. Cable, cable tensioner right down in this area here which puts the pressure on the, on the cable itself. Uh, you can see as we pull the cable out, the cable stays nice and easy. Okay. It's very important to have a cable tensioner on it. Here is a new cable tensioner here. Okay, that goes like I said on the bottom of the drum to hold your cable in. Here is an old one that is completely worn out. If you have something like that on there, it's going to eat up uh, a new cable in no time at all. So make sure you got a cable tensioner on it. Take care of your cable. Also, I'm going to show you here. You don't want to. You don't want to use a, a chain to pull your cable because if you're pulling something up and you got you're pulling just with a chain here, the steel is going to end up cutting your cable up here. So, so that'll ruin the cable? That will ruin it and destroy it. It starts start fraying out little pieces and end up messing up the cable. I'll show you what you need to do down here. If you've got to pull from the side, you want to have your snatch block. Put this in here. And then as you can see here, you've got a roller and it will pull the cable this way without, without messing up your cable. Now, uh, <laughs> now what about the, the other cable that doesn't have the positive latch on it? Well, uh, it doesn't have the positive latch on it. Very easy, especially this is, a, this is just a little clip here that, uh, that holds the load in, holds the chain in, the bridle or whatever you got. And, and when this very easy can break off and mess up. And if it does, then the, then the hook can just fall right out of here because you got nothing to hold it. And you end up losing the load, uh, you know. So you're better off to make sure the cable's in good shape or use the positive latch because uh, the cable, like I said, $62, $92. Or if you lose a car off of this, I mean, you could be talking about, uh, uh, you know, thousands of dollars in damage and the insurance go up and, and all that stuff. So uh, make sure you change your cable. Uh, when needed. Uh, let me show you an old cable here also. See this one was on the truck that came in here that we replaced. You see how it's got all the little pieces here on it that's where part of it is broken already. It's flat. Uh, the cable is completely destroyed. Uh, you know for a $62 cable uh, you could end up costing yourself uh, thousands and thousands of dollars damage to your car, maybe even, uh, even kill someone. So when the cable smashed like that or has kinks in it it's a good idea to replace the cable yes, right away replace the cable because it can break uh, it can break and you can have major problems like I said with uh, losing the car 
uh, hitting someone, doing body uh, damage, and uh, and end up costing you a lot of money. So, so replace your cable, uh, save money, uh, take care of your truck, and take care of you. Thank you, Cliff.